Hi friends, this is Mohammed Shakil here and in this tutorial I'm going to show you how you can design a late slide rest in Kitia V5. On the right side you can see the completed design of the late slide with, with rest with uh, all the particular parts being assembled together and on the left side you can see the different drawings which are required to complete the design. And in this tutorial part we are going to design the fourth part that is a slide block which you can see over here. And in this assembly you can see the slide block is being positioned over here so this is a slide block we're going to design and you can take a look at, look at it and we'll just open up the part design workbench to get a new drawing space where I'm going to show you how you can design it alright the late slide rest is the product name and space 4 is the part number space the slide was a part name it's a slide block the slide block okay come okay now come into the drawing and first of all consider this as a front view and this as a side view on the front plane click sketch and draw this sketch exactly the same way so in this particular uh, tutorial I'm going to show you a different uh, way of designing it. And just delete this and this and create the square first. Dimension the square is yes, 95 the total height is 48 All right and just dimension this with this okay now again draw this you must be wondering why I'm doing this but there is a reason I said I'm gonna explain you a different way of designing okay replace this here and this distance is uh, 28 10 this particular method of designing is being used in some industries so 8 and 14 and this is totally at an offset of 33 don't leave the drawing until and unless the whole drawing changes to green come out of the sketch okay this is your front drawing now what you're going to do is <coughs> you're going to select this face this plane give on sketch and select these four edges here project it come out <coughs> and then do a padding of 122 okay now you're going to insert another body right click define and work object and give sketch this time you're going to select these edges here project and give a pocket reverse direction 122 okay now right click assemble alright now we can go to the part body and hide this first sketch we have done now again come to the side view insert another body right click define and work object select this face come into the sketch and do this particular sketch here
dimension it of an angle of uh, 55 degrees this is at a distance of uh, 10 and this one of 17 this is at a height of uh, 35 and we got it completely green come out of the sketch and do a pocket of what is the distance 95 95 okay now right click body assemble it we got another part being removed over there so this is the industrial industrial way of doing it like you are doing a pocket in another body and you're assembling it all right now by using the uh, boolean commands okay now we need to drill some holes over here 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 and here and we're gonna see that in the next part of the tutorial so i hope you enjoyed this particular part and if you have any doubts or clarifications regarding this part please uh, comment below on my video and i'll be getting in touch with you you can also write to me at katia.pro.user at gmail.com c-a-t-i-a.pro.user at gmail.com regarding any cat projects and you can also follow me on the blog www cad made easy c a d m a d e e a s y s y dot blogspot dot com that's it and stay tuned for the next parts and uh, hopefully we'll assemble the whole parts together in the final tutorial thank you so much for watching